Okay. Um, my question is, uh, are you not running out of time as, as the, 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 the legal team and the, for your client to be on the ballot on the, in a few days' time? Well, I think the first thing for me to say is the outcome of the appeal itself. Uh, you were in court and you heard that uh, the appeal was dismissed. We were not given any reason why the appeal was dismissed, but we were told that the reasons are going to follow. But uh, as a prelude to, 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 to whatever that I'm going to say, I must mention that uh, as a nation, we are on an eve of a constitution, constitutional and uh, electoral crisis. Because uh, we have the Apex Court, which is the constitutional court, and we have received instructions immediately from our client to take up the next available step in order to make sure that uh, he remains on the ballot papers. So I wouldn't say we are out of time uh, in order to in order to in order to protect the best interests of our of our client. We didn't sleep. We have papers in our beds, and they will be filed. Unfortunately, I cannot. Uh, uh, put all the cards for you to see what we are going to do, but uh, surely uh, this decision is going to be challenged, challenged in no time. I must, I must say. Um, the, the, the court has ruled that they will provide the reasons for their decision, um, and and you definitely need those those those, those reasons for you to lodge. Uh, uh, well, well, uh, well, well. In a matter of public importance like this one, you would expect, with respect, that the court uh, gives you the reasons for dismissing the appeal. But then the court chose to go the other way and say that the reasons are going to follow. But we do not need the, the reasons because what we are challenging is not the reasons of the of the court, but we are challenging the order itself. So with or without the reasons, we will be able to navigate. In fact, today we will navigate, and uh, and our client will be back on the ballot on the ballot papers.